Why, hello there. Didn't see you there. My name is Guy. So, we're doing a solo run of Pokemon Heart Gold. Wow! I never thought you would do this. Heart Gold's one of the, like, very few games under Gen 6 that I've actually been. Um, it was basically a solo run. Like, I had three Pokemon the whole game. And I, at one point I was using all three of them, but then I just went back to using my starter. My starter was a Ferelegator. I forgot what it was called. Anyway, so it, I also was using the Toga tick, the Togepi you get a lot, and I like evolved it, and I was using that a lot. Other than like I, they were like on par, and then I got Hello, and Hello was like only level forty five, and they're both like level fifty three. And then I just swept through the entire Elite Four with Alligator, and at that point he was, like, way higher level than both of them. And he knew Earthquake. And he wrecked everyone. So, uh... Larvitar, the rock-type Pokemon. Um, so... Yeah, we're gonna name our Larvitar... Girl. Stonehenge. I don't know why I'm naming it Stonehenge. Anyway, so, um, yeah, I'm thinking about the hard thing, the, the, uh, hard battles we're gonna have. <laughs> hard because it's wrong. Um, so, I think the first gym, I don't think will be too hard. Even though I don't think we'll get a rock move by it, but they, we resist all their, like, tackles and quick attacks and flying moves and all that stuff. Um, so, second gym, what's just the second gym? Bugsy, I think we can take. Third gym's Whitney. Whitney's always annoying, even if you have a fighting type. Um... Fourth gym. Price? Price won't be hard. Um, Price could, uh, like, ice move us, but we could rock move him. Um, who else is? Person. Who else exists? Um, I don't, uh, this is out of order, but Claire. Claire, I don't think. I think Claire will be fine. Um, I'm forgetting all. Whatever, we'll see when we get there. It's just that I feel like Larvitar doesn't get enough love, and Larvitar, Tyranitar, they're all amazing Pokemon, and they deserve to be loved. I mean, would I say best Pokemon, my favorite Pokemon? No. Great Pokemon that should be respected. Yeah. So I was thinking about doing some Mario 64. Would you guys like some Mario 64? Because I've never actually been that. I played it a little bit. Wasn't. The... So the thing is, when I played that, it was right after I played uh, Super Mario Odyssey. So I thought it was. I kept doing like, oh, if you ground pound, then jump. You jump higher. No, it doesn't work like that. Or like, I'm going to start a roll. That wasn't a thing. But, or, I got a capture card. I think maybe we could do some Super Mario Odyssey Superstar mode. Some Breath of the Wild. I want to do like a challenge run of Dragon Quest Builders. And if we can hook it up to my Wii Punch Out... And Mario Galaxy. Skyward Sword 2, but like, Skyward Sword wasn't my favorite Zelda game. It was a good, it's a good game. No, it shouldn't be hated as much as it gets hate, but it's not my favorite. I haven't even been in it, which I, I know that kind of sounds bad because I say the game's not that good. Well, it is good saying my ga the game's not my favorite because I haven't been in it. <laughs> Um, the funny thing, 
is if anyone saw the E3 reveal trailer um, for Skyward Sword, it's kind of sad to watch, but it's um, funny. Basically, what happened if you didn't watch it? Spoiler No, no one cares. Um, uh, Miyamoto was playing the game with like some guy, and it wasn't working. Most of the girls weren't working. It was funny to watch, but the most interesting part of the game happened. Um, so, anyway, Pokemon, back to Pokemon. Pokemon's always been kind of great game to record and do challenges runs to. One of my favorite games. Pokemon, one of the games would be in my top 10. Which I also interested in making. Top 10 games, me. I'd probably be like, they're all really good games. And if I had to put one from every genre, I think you guys would assume what genres I'd do. Just two of them. Well, three of them. Well, okay. Mr. Egg, completely useless. Also, we are going to be using HM Slaves. Let me just make sure I'm recording. Um, so, yeah. Um, so this is Tyranitar. Well, this is so... I really want to play Punch-Out, because I ordered it. It's coming soon. And punch I went over to my friend's house a couple days ago and we hooked up his Wii. And we we're playing a ton of Wii games like Mario Galaxy and stuff that we hadn't played in a while. We we're playing some Punch Out. I never played Punch Out. He said Punch Out was probably his favorite game ever made. I was like, okay, Punch Out it's a classic, but it's probably I I've never played it, so I don't know. But then I started playing it, and then I had so much fun that I just ordered it. <laughs> So anyway, we're going to fight a rival. I forgot who I, who, which starter I replaced Larvitar with. So if they have a Cyndaquil, because I replaced it with uh, Chikorita, dog, um, then that just adds... Sprout challenge probably isn't going to be the hardest challenge. I will. Because there's been challenges like Ladybot only, or like Ditto. Ditto only? Okay, good. Um, Ditto only? Ditto. Especially, like, in the older games. But, like, I'm wrecking them, too. Um. Yeah, I think this is probably gonna be the, the um, this is probably gonna be the end. Just let me go get through all this. So, this is basically just the starting of the journey. Like, we didn't really do any hard battles. We just wrecked everything. Blah, blah, blah. I don't care. Some guy came in, stole Pokemon. I beat him up. Okay, so now we gotta name our rival. And I named my guy Boy, so you're gonna be named... Yeah, my rival's name is Bald. <laughs> Guess his name isn't Bald. Oh, but we're still naming him Bald. <laughs> it's kind of weird that Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 4, Gen 5, Gen... Yeah. Why did they cut out that you could name your rival in Gen 6 and 7? Probably because that's when they added the uh, name blocking. And they realized it wouldn't be as bad if you named your Pokemon something bad as if you named your rival something bad. Because that would just be like people calling him like whatever you named him. That probably wouldn't be good. Anyway, so um, yeah, this is my first episode. Um, Mario 64. Mario 64. Maybe um, I'm interested in doing some fan games of Zelda. I don't know why I'm spamming buttons, because that doesn't do anything. Also, why do you never get a fight, this person? Why do you never get a fight? Okay, dude, these Pokeballs are money. Why do you never get a fight your rival? Anyway, so, uh... Yeah.
There we go. That probably was very short. And I'm sorry if it's short, but we're going to do some stuff. Bye. Oh, wait.